Hello and in this video, we are going to learn a proper way to add a new page in Word. So you can see here that I'm working on a Word document and I'm in the middle of a page. I want to add a new page in order to start a new session. Now normally whenever we face this problem, what we normally do is that we could press enter a few times until we get to the new page. But please don't do that and let me show you what happened. So suppose that we add a new page, right? Okay, so far so good, but later on when the when the document grows, all more text are being added in the first page. Let's see what happens. So you can see here that the page will be pushed down forcibly and our text will not start at the beginning of the page like we used to, but it will be pushed down at least one paragraph down and this is not what we want. So the proper way to do this is to go to insert, go to page break, and you can see that we will now be adding a new page. So it will be page 2, okay? So now we can add a new text to it. Now the good thing about this method is that even when the document grows or more text are being added to the first page, the second page format will not be impacted. The, the text from the second page will always start at the top of the second page, which is exactly what we want. Okay, so, so far so good. Now, what if you want to add a new page in the middle of the document? So this is the introduction part and this is the recommendation part. And, and now I want to add another section as execution. Alright, and let's put it as heading 1. So now I want each section to start on a separate page. Now how do we do that? Very simple, just again click on the beginning of the section that you want to start a new page go to insert go to page break and now execution will be on a separate page again do the same thing for recommendation all right and now let's go and add more content to the execution part all right and you can see that no matter how how much text are being added to the execution part recommendation will always start on a new page Okay, so let me copy the last two paragraphs and then add to it. So you can see that whenever we add new text, the document will grow, but the recommendation section will always start on a new page, which is exactly what we want. So remember, if you want to add a new page in Word, always add by go to insert and select page break. You will never go wrong with this method. So. I hope you found this video useful. That's it for now. Happy learning and see you in the next video.